It's 9 p.m. on a Friday, which can only mean one thing if you're on Get Active TV or One Place Sports. It is time for evenings with John and Duncan. A very happy Labor Day to everyone watching. And today it is the Athletes Game Show. Who do we have on for today, John? A very exciting matchup, of course, today in our martial arts edition with Chelsea and Sim from Taekwondo and Sheikh Fadaus from Silat. Two individuals you would not want to mess with if you were down in a dark alley at night. We had great stuff last week with Kirsten and Shahid. I think this week will be much more competitive, as you said, the martial arts edition. S- slightly different games this week. Mm-hmm. Um, you, you guys may want to just stay tuned yes. to find out what they are. Yes, very interesting indeed. So let's get on the call with Chelsea and Fidaus. Let's do it. It's great to have Fidaus and Chelsea and Sim with us for Athletes Game Show. John, we had a great start last week, but I think now with the martial artists on screen with us, it might be even more ferocious in the challenge, don't you think? Well, certainly, I think so. I'm looking forward to today's challenge, actually. Are you guys aware of what the three challenges are? Um, I only know one uh, of them. Yeah, only one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we will, we, will, we will educate you right now about what the challenges are. So there are three challenges. Best of two wins it. There is going to be a forfeit. Okay, just a warning at the end of it. And it's going to be a tough one. Okay, like a, a personal trainer buff guy is going to actually tell you what you guys need to do as a forfeit. So the first challenge is you need to mimic the yoga pose. So someone is going to tell you this is the yoga pose and you need to mimic it as closely and as accurately as you can. The second one is two facts and a lie. So you have um, two thrown in... Two truths and a lie. You have sent in your um, facts and your lie, so you will have a go against each other on that. And the final one is charades. Always uh, a classic, always something that just gets laughs uh, from everyone involved. So those are the three challenges. Best of three, two to win it. Yeah, all set. Are you guys ready to yeah. go? Ready to go. Space, enough space behind you or not? Uh, but I was... I have, I have, I have. Must be full body or no? Yes. Cannot have body. Okay, I, I, I will, I will bring it down. I'll bring this. <laughs> okay. Down. All right. Okay. So let's get, let's get into it straight away. What Mimic else? the yoga pose. Okay, John. So we have eight. No, we have six. six. We have six yoga poses for you. Uh, I think it goes from easy to moderate to. Difficult. I would say the difficult somewhere in the middle. Like. Right, the difficult ones. I I'll be impressed if you can do all six of them. Okay. Yeah. So let's see how many. They let's can see do. how many you can do. So let's go with the first one. Hey Chelsea and Fidals. So the first pose for today is Cobra pose. Lie down on your belly. Bring your feet together. Place your hands underneath your shoulders. Then press into your palms. Inhale, lift the chest and chin. You can keep the belly down on the ground for baby cobra, or you can come up all the way, straighten up the elbows, look up towards the ceiling, draw the shoulders back and down, so create a lot of space in your neck. And once you are done, slowly lower yourself all the way down to the ground and release your arms. Who's going to go first? Yes, yeah! Okay. <laughs> Ladies, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna Chelsea's take, I'm gonna gonna take the scores here. Who does the best? Cobra pose. Okay. Chelsea's gonna do the cobra pose. Okay. Ah, easy, la. Too easy. Too, Too easy. easy. Okay, Fida was joking. Okay, okay, now it's Fida was. Hang on, I'm gonna okay. switch the. Okay. <laughs> Ready. Yeah. Ah, okay. Okay. <laughs> so one point to both of you. That was very very easy. That was very easy. Easy okay. start. Okay. So pose number two gets a little bit more difficult. Let's have a have a look. Let me just open up pose number two. It's the eagle pose. Yeah, this is the eagle pose. Okay, so I, I'm going to share this with you also. I need to share screen. Give me a second. Share screen and then this one. Second pose for today is eagle pose. Okay, so come to the front of your mat or whatever space you are in. Inhale, reach your arms up to the sky. Exhale, cross the right arm underneath the left. You can hook once or you can hook twice. Okay, see if you can bring the palms together. Bend your knees. Lift the right leg up, cross the right thigh over, and try to hook the right toes behind the right, uh, the left calf. Pull the right hip back, 
lift the elbows, lean the shoulders back. Shoulders should be right above your hips. Look directly forward, pull your hands away from your face. Then try to sit a little bit deeper. Then once you're ready, slowly come out, release your legs. Inhale, reach your arms up to the sky. Exhale, release your arms. Oh. You go first, I went first just now. So who's going first? Fidaos, are you confident? No, Fidaos. Okay. Hang on a second, hang on a second. I got to pin his... Uh... Okay, hang on. Is he really pinning? Oh, he's really pinning. Okay, okay Fidaos, go. Eagle pose. <laughs> no, hand first, hand first, hand first. Hand oh, first. first. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, then the legs. Pretty good. I would, I would give him a pass for that one. Again, again, again. Again, again. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Chelsea, your turn. Now it's okay. Chelsea. Eddie. Mm, the other way around, the other yeah, way around. Legs, legs have to be other way around. Yeah. Uh, yes. And then I think your arm gonna, your arm gonna, your arm gonna go. Yeah, I'm gonna exit the face like this. Yes, okay. And then the legs. And then, and then the legs. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Very impressive, very impressive, very impressive. Very impressive. Okay, so I would say both of you have done the first two poses very uh, confidently, very easily. The third one is called the crow pose. Uh, this one a bit, you all might need cushion, I think. I mean, I don't know, maybe you, maybe you all won't need, like, you all, but I'm, for me, I would definitely need. Like, okay, let's have a look at what the crow pose is. That is. Next pose, the third pose is crow pose. So you come into a squat, this should be quite fun for you. Spread the fingers, lift your heels, lift the hips. Look forward, look ahead of your fingers, don't look at your hands. Lean forward. Lean forward, use your fingertips to grip the mat. Then once you're ready, float one foot off, maybe float the other foot off the ground. Okay, then once you're ready, slowly lower both feet down onto the mat and come back into your squat. Who's gonna go first? Okay, I'll Chelsea. try to say. Okay, Chelsea okay, first. Chelsea first. Wait, 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 let me get a pillow in case my face hit the <laughs> Okay. Okay, okay. Whoa! Whoa! Pretty good. Wow! Not bad. Not bad, not not bad at all. Not bad. Oh, Fido, okay. on. The pressure. Why do I need pressure? <laughs> oh, dear friend here. <laughs> Daddy, I so. think he can do it. Hey, I, I don't think think think. Oh, yeah, your screen at first. Can I can yeah, it? Oh. Okay. Oh. Wow. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Incredible. Oh, hey. oh, this is pretty good. Okay. Athletes are athletes at the end of the day, feel the same. Wow, three done, for guys. three for both of you. Well so done. Proud of you guys. Oh, it's easy, man. Okay, so three down, three to go. Pose number four is the intimidating flying pigeon. Off pose for today is flying pigeon. Okay, so this one is super fun, even better than the last one. Cross the right ankle over the left, bend your left knee, sit the hips down. Then lean forward, you'll feel a nice stretch in the right hip. Slowly place both hands on the ground. Snuggle your shin on both triceps. Okay, then use your right ankle to hook your left elbow, left arm. Lean forward, press down into your hands, look forward, float the left foot up. You can see if you can extend the left leg up to the sky. Whoa! Catch, extend, hold, three, two, one and slowly lower the left leg all the way down and release your legs and inhale slowly stand all the way up so that's our fourth pose we go to level of difficulty how difficult is this yoga pose crazy <laughs> you, got, you got to start like, like moving our legs like crazy <laughs> <laughs> let's see if you can do it first and then you see whether you can do the extension but do like pose, if, pose, if, pose, if there's yeah. any consolation Personally, I feel this is already the toughest. The other two is not like this. Is probably the oh, they, you, they haven't seen five I mean, and six yet. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, who's gonna go first for this? Who's one? confident enough? Fidel, Fidel, go. Fidel goes first. Okay. <laughs> you have to cross your leg first. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Can't do this yeah. I'm not I'm nowhere near Whoa. Uh, flexible. Whoa. Wow, 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 wow. Can you do the extension? Oh. Almost can you do the extension? Oh. 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 
Oh, that's, a, that's a good effort. That's a good effort. That's a good effort. That's a good effort. Tough one, man. It's that's a one. tough one. It's a tough one. I wouldn't say you pass. We can't, we can't give that to him. You, yeah. you need to almost, there, almost there, Eddie. Almost there. Almost there. Almost yeah. there. We can't give it to you, but almost there. Chelsea, your turn. The spotlight now is on Chelsea. Yeah. For the lead, by the way. No pressure. For the lead. Yeah, and she, it's... Uh, actually, maybe on... Uh, yeah, is it? That's the closing. I can see the closing. Okay. This is Chelsea's attempt at... Good effort. She got some <laughs> air time in that one. <laughs> she, she got some air time. Yeah, yeah. Okay, never mind. Okay, we're still we're still tight. We're tight at three all. Okay. Still tight at three all. Okay. 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 All set. Okay, so half one, the flying pigeon. Now pose number five is called the bridge. Okay, this is our fifth pose. It is a real pose of chakrasana. Lie down on your back, press down into your feet, or if you want to do it from a standing position, you can also. Place your hands underneath your shoulders. Press down into your feet. Your feet should be pointing forward, so don't turn the toes out. Press down into your feet. Lift the hips. Okay, once you are here, press strongly into your hands top of the head on the ground. Wrap the knees, wrap the elbows, and straighten up your arms. Push your chest all the way back. Okay, hang out here for a while. Maybe two breaths. Then once you are done, slowly come back the same way. Lower the head down. Tuck the chin to the chest, and slowly lower yourselves all the way down. That's your fifth pose. Uh, <laughs> hey, Chelsea. Hey, hang on, wait for the screen. Uh, man, now it's uh, only recording her screen. Again. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, anytime you're ready, Chelsea. Anytime you're ready. Wow, it's uh, <laughs> too easy, man. She does that like her warm up. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, too easy, it man. That was she too does it for easy. Warm up, she does it for warm up. Oh man, she does it for warm up. Okay, now. But that was how you feeling about that one? Nothing for him was on lah. Hold on, it's on. How come he no got? How come he got yoga mat? Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> you know beforehand he yoga. Got no yoga mat then. Oh, I don't know. Okay, so we are tight, okay? <laughs> After five poses, it's 4-4. Four, four. This is a decider. We have to get a winner on this one, John. We have to get a winner. Um, oh, yeah, this yeah. is a decider. This is a decider. What if it's, what if it's a tie? Okay, then, then it's then, a tie. We then, have another two. Yeah, then we, we have, have no another, choice. Yeah, the other two, we have another decider. Two. Okay, let's, okay, let's go with the so, last So, um, I mean, we saved the best for last, basically. The, the final one is the headstand. Final and sixth pose for today is headstand. If you're alone at home, maybe go to a wall so that you're safe. Okay, so make sure that your shoulders are right underneath, uh, your sh elbows are right underneath the shoulders. Interlace your fingers, tuck the pinky finger in. And once you're ready, tuck the toes, lift your hips. Open your hands like an open book, stick the thumbs out. Tuck your chin to your chest, place the top of your head on the ground. Pull the shoulders away from your ears. Tuck the toes, lift your knees, draw the belly in. Walk your feet forward. Okay, I'll give you an easy transition, okay? Float one foot up. Lean forward, tilt the hips, lift the other foot off the ground. Okay, press down into your elbows. Maybe lift your legs up to the sky. Try your best to straighten up your whole body. Press down into your arms. Then to come out, slowly bring your knees to your chest again. And slowly sit back into a child's pose. Rest your forehead now. That is your final challenge for today. If you need to use the, the wall, yeah, I perhaps, think it's better to use if you, the wall, if you need to use the wall, you can. The is to support the neck. Yeah. Do you want to do it? Or you so, who's first? So, you! I went first, Jessica! Okay, I'm going to try. Ah, 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 yeah. Is he going for it? Going for it. I'm gonna record him already. Oh this is the nose. Okay. Walking in. Okay. So far, so good. Yeah. So far, so good. Whoa! Almost, oh, almost, almost. 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 <laughs> almost. <laughs> almost. <laughs> I can just let him win. <laughs> okay. Are we gonna give that to him? Uh, Chelsea. Okay, okay I mean, we'll see how Chelsea does yeah. this one. <laughs> 
A for effort though. It's A for effort for that one. I think uh, it's good. Oh, wow. oh, good. You can feel like your arm is supporting your head. I don't know how to explain. It's just yeah. Don't push yourself into it. Okay. <laughs> oh, I think. Well, we we are the judges here. What do you think? Fidel's. Fidel's I think Fidel's. Fidel's. We give you that first one. Yes! <laughs> mimic the yoga pose. So, congratulations. You won the first challenge. Well done, guys. Well done. Amazing. Fantastic. A commendable Amazing. Yeah. You, to be honest, when, when the six yoga poses came in, uh, I personally was thinking they wouldn't be able to do two. Or, I mean, I only be able three, to do two uh, or three, three of yeah. half of it. Yeah. But, but you guys you have exceeded so expectations, exceeded expectations, definitely. Fantastic. Well done. Truths and a lie. Now, we have both your facts. How we're going to do this uh, part of the game is each of you will take turns to share three facts about yourself, yep. of which two are truths and one is a lie. Is a lie. Yep. Yeah. And uh, you guys have shared that with us. We, we, know, we, know, the yeah. 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 we know the answers yeah. because you have shared that with us. But that doesn't mean I'm not going to mess with your head yeah. uh, during, <laughs> during the period. <laughs> so, who is going to go first? You let me know so that I can, um, I can pin your video. Yeah, so who wants to go first? Let the winner go first. <laughs> let the winner go first. Okay, <laughs> that was the go with the first one. Okay. Uh, the first is, I started Silat at age 10. The second is, I've been to 20 countries. The third is, I don't like the chocolate flavor. You see, all, all plausible. Um, I think... You have to choose the lie, right? You have, you have to, to choose, choose the lie. lie, yes. So, I think, you know, starting at age 10, it's about the right age. Maybe a bit earlier. I think the chocolate is the lie. Oh, she just went for it. <laughs> I don't like the chocolate flavour. Is she correct, Fidel's? She's wrong. Oh! You know why? Obviously, the lie will be... I started Sila at age 10. My dad is already the champion. So I've really studied when I was young. Way younger. I was <laughs> so how young? How young? Is <laughs> I don't know. I probably like, I was born into the sport. You know? Like at three years old, I was already wearing the uniform. Alright. <laughs> well See, done. Okay, it's a tricky okay. one. Okay, it's a tricky, tricky one. one. It's yeah. a tricky one. It's a tricky one. So Chelsea, you don't get that point. point. Yeah, Chelsea, you don't. Yeah, okay. Now yeah. it's up now to you. Now it's your turn to respond. With Chelsea, your Yeah. Okay. I love sweet things, I hate fried food, and I don't eat vegetables. Sweet things, she hates fried food, and she doesn't eat vegetables. Wow, tough, man. This um, is tough. I, 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 all three are possible, actually. I mean, but have have to eat oh, oh, it's right? the first one again? So she she likes I love sweet things. things. She hates I hate fried food, fried food, and I don't eat vegetables. Yeah. Man, you have to eat vegetables though, right? I think number two. I was, I, <laughs> which is the lie? I think, it's not, I think the lie is um, the second one. Um, you don't like fried food. Is that the correct answer? <laughs> it seems like a yes. <laughs> uh, I mean, I mean, I mean, come on, let's talk about McDonald's, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, you're right. Yes. <laughs> So that is the lie. She hates uh, fried food, no? No, I love fried food. Two fiddles. Okay. Uh, the next one is, I have four siblings. Second, I hate running. And the third, I've never broken a bone. Now you see, I think Sila, you know, it's, it's tough. It's a tough sport. You might, be, you might break bones during this. I don't know. I have no idea what the answer is. Um, 
I'm just, I don't know. Chelsea, what do you think? He is running. Well, he no, I think he likes running. So I think that's a lie. <laughs> you think he loves running? Uh, like is... Okay. Uh, I hate running. I hate running. Yeah, it's, I really hate running. I hate running. Yeah. So which is, the, which is the lie? The lie is I have four siblings. Because you have more. Yeah, I have five. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they love doing that. Oh, oh man. I hate running. I hate running. Don't, don't. Well, you make it seem like you like it. Yeah, you hate running. Yeah. 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 running. Okay. Uh, Understandable. Chelsea, your goal. Okay. I have been to three C games. I won five Commonwealth Champs gold medals before. And I was in a table tennis school team. Ooh. <laughs> Shit, that's a lot of gold medals in the game. The first time is what you've been to four C games. Three C games. Three C games, that's true. Second? I won five Commonwealth Champs gold medals before. Possible. And then, Don't the Google, last is, uh. <laughs> and then the last Google is. Now. I was in a table tennis school team. Table tennis? <laughs> Googling! Googling! <laughs> 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 no, 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 I think the second is a lie. The Commonwealth? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, the lie is I win uh, the three C games. So I went oh, to four. 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 You went to Myanmar, is it? Woo! Yeah, Myanmar. Oh, That's finally. Right. <laughs> right. Thinking okay. like, you, did you go to Myanmar or not? <laughs> That's, That's right. right. No, in fact, no. Chelsea was at Myanmar and she, uh, you, you performed as well in the closing ceremony. I the closing ceremony. <laughs> Oh, good memory, John. Yeah, that, that, that was very good memory. I yeah. really <laughs> okay. Um, <clears throat> the first one is I'm good at basketball. The second, I've tried bungee jumping. The third is I used to play the angklong. <laughs> oh my god! Angklong version angklong. What angklong? It's like a musical <laughs> musical instrument, isn't it? I think it's the musical instrument. Hmm. I'm good at basketball. Does he look like the basketball player? Dude? Does he strike you as Chelsea, 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 you can ask Delvin. Delvin uh, yeah, you need to ask Delvin. That one is subjective. He's good at basketball. Subjective. Phone a friend. I mean, I mean, I mean, you can't compare me to Delvin, obviously. Try buying more possibilities. Chelsea. Mm. <laughs> you need to get, get this right, by the way. Basketball. <laughs> Basketball is a lie. Oh. Is it? The truth? Is that your answer? The lie, the lie. Yeah. Yeah, that's the lie. <laughs> oh, that is the lie. Well done. Well done. Well done, Chelsea. Final. Okay, okay. okay. It's a tie. Okay, so, so Pidaos, uh, you, uh, you, 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 if you get this right, you win, you win it. Okay. Chelsea, do your, your best. I have three cats. I've been to Trinidad and Tobago. And Taekwondo was the first sport that I wanted to try. Has she been to Trinidad and Tobago? That's a very obscure place to go. Trinidad and Tobago? <laughs> that sounds a bit... Hmm. I don't see any cats on the... wandering around, you know, so... I, mean, I, know, know. Know. I, know. I know she has three fat cats. <laughs> oh, you know that? You know that fat? Oh, well, she has three cats, yeah. okay. So it's between uh, Trinidad and Tobago and was Taekwondo was the first spot that she ever was it wanted to try. Yeah. yeah. For the win. <laughs> Chelsea's reaction uh, there funny. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm thinking the lie is is the Third one. The third one. Yeah, there's a lie. Are you sure? 
Yes. But I've done Taekwondo for 13 years. 14 years. Wait, why are you like asking me to change my answer? Asking <laughs> <laughs> you to change things. I, I, don't, I don't know, maybe you wanted to try I'm giving you try. background facts. <laughs> so what is the lie, Chelsea? Oh, he's right. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> Alright, but congratulations, congratulations. So what was the first sport that you wanted to try, Chelsea? Gymnastic. 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 Yeah. Well, I, I'm sure yeah, she yeah, would have been a fantastic yeah. gymnast. Yeah. Yeah. Been, well, she's, uh, I mean, she's super flexible and even beyond that. Animals? Animals. Okay, animals, animals. Okay. Okay, hang on a second. I'm going to send this to you. Chelsea. 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 So we'll time it in one minute. How many? How many? Uh... You receive it? You receive it already? Yeah. yeah. So I in three, two, one. one. Go. Go. Monkey. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, crocodile. No, no, pass, no. pass, pass, pass. Okay, pass, pass, pass. pass. <laughs> Elephant. Decent. <laughs> And what is that? Second, 30 Friday. seconds. Yes, correct. Yes, correct. Can, I, can I make the sound? <laughs> no sound. No sounds. <laughs> it's charades. Oh, no sounds. No sounds. Huh? What is that? What is that? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Five. Five. Four. Four. Three. three. Two, two, one, one. Up. No, 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 no. no. Was it, it was chicken? chicken? Was it? No, no. Hey, that's four. That's four. That. That's four. Uh, your, options uh, your options are daily activities, daily activities professions, professions, and games. And games. Um, daily activities. Daily activities. Daily activities. John, I'll just get you ready. And okay. 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 And okay. So my on my count, count. In three, two, one, one. Make up. Right. Yeah. Um. Ah. Uh, Buckle <laughs> uh, your belt. Yeah. 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 Okay. Right. Yes, right. Can. Um. Thirty seconds. Second. <laughs> Brushing teeth. Okay. Yes. Okay. Correct. Button. Okay. Yeah. Fifteen seconds. Seconds left. Golf. Wait, I can't Five, see your hand. What are you doing? Four. Three. More. Two. One. one Sweep. Four. Four. Interesting uh, athlete game show. Yeah. yeah. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. Uh, and, uh, it has to be but there has to be a winner. There has to be a winner. If it else, and if it else, else, you are the winner okay. of <laughs> this episode's <laughs> athlete game show. Congratulations. Congratulations on the winner today. <laughs> Thank you. Also, but that also means there's a forfeit. That means there is also a forfeit for you, Chelsea. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. It's, it's a doozy. It's a doozy. <laughs> okay, let's see what okay, we let's have. Let's see what Chelsea. we have for Chelsea. Yeah, it's courtesy, yeah, it's from, courtesy our from our friends of House Athletics, and um, they have a very special forfeit for you. Hey, Chelsea! Unfortunately, you lost. So this is your forfeit. You're gonna go in a plank position and give me explosive push-ups. Bring your feet and your palms off the floor. You've got 20 reps of this. There you go. Enjoy that 20 perfect reps. Be sure to tag your friends so we can all be accountable. Yeah. yeah. 
Oh. I'm just gonna do it now. Okay, okay there, there we go. go. <laughs> Whenever you're ready. One, two, two three, four, four, five, six, six seven, seven, eight, nine, nine ten, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Almost there. Eighteen. 19, 20! <laughs> incredible! Well, incredible! Wow! Absolutely Thanks for joining us today. Yeah, yeah. really appreciate Thank you for having us. Joining us. Thank you for having us. Please, Please stay, stay safe. safe. Yeah. yeah. Stay, stay safe. safe. Um, um, keep inspiring, inspiring the rest of Singapore with what you guys do when you're at home. And uh, we hope to see you guys soon. Yeah, yeah. yeah. when this is all over, we'll see you in competitions once again. Take care. Yeah. Yeah. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Fantastic fun with Chelsea and Fidel's John. Some laughs, some unexpected twists, but plenty of great stuff. Well, we certainly have seen two very exciting episodes of the Athlete Game Show already. Yeah. And I do hope that our athletes will not want to stop playing these games simply because of the forfeits that come every week. Some tough forfeits uh, in the past two weeks, but you know, these guys are athletes. They are capable of doing them of course so really looking forward to the next episode but we will be back on Monday for our evenings with John and Duncan and it is Spotlight on Team Singapore and we have our very own Team Singapore bowler in Shana Ng looking forward to that one John definitely stay tuned to that interview coming right up with one of Team Singapore's female bowlers that have helped put us on the world map we'll see you on Monday Good night. Good night. <laughs>